Good morning guys and welcome back. So today we're replacing the old clapped out and ratty steering stabilizer from the JK. Now this is probably way overdue. This thing's been leaking. It's old and crusty. Pretty sure it's got a few holes in the back of it and it's just kind of covered in dirt and it doesn't really compress. Oh, and when it does compress, oh, rather than lack of compress, oh, comes down a long way. So we'll be replacing the factory steering stabilizer in the 2010 JK um, with a Terraflex 9550 oversized steering stabilizer. Look at the size difference between the stock one and the new Terraflex one massive difference you can see compared to like those shaft sizes massive difference now this is an oversized one this is a Terraflex one this is made for uh, JK's TJ's XJ's I'm not sure about like the YJ's and stuff like that uh, but the direct bolt-on replacement we've got a kit now we bought, we bought this kit from SBR off-road in WA I think this was hundred and one dollars plus twenty dollars for overnight shipping which is $121, it's really good quality. I'm really excited to see how the actual feeling of this is different than the factory one. Obviously it's a much beefier um, construction and considering that one is what 21 years old now and it's been probably through a lot of abuse. This is a brand new Terraflex one built for off-road use. We're keen to see the difference um, on the two different stabilizers. 9550 steering stabilizer is designed to work with modified suspension and larger off road tires to reduce um, steering wobbles, shakes, and stuff like that when you're off road. Will fit 2007 2018 JK. It's got an oversized 2 inch body, as you can see from the factory one, um, and 5.8 hardened chrome rod alloy for heavy duty upgraded premium seal to be vent. Um, water leakages, um, water seeping and dirt seeping into the actual seals of it and compared to the factory one it is massive I don't know if you guys can see the big difference between the factory one and the Terraflex one now I was kind of the, contemplating which one to go for and I reckon the Terraflex one is actually the best bang for buck um, compared with the steering stabilizers for 102 bucks for an upgraded steering stabilizer you can't go wrong and because it's branded it's not like a cheap um, eBay one I was going to go for a cheap eBay one but for I think it's like an extra twenty dollars for the Terraflex one. It's a great branded. Uh, Terraflex makes awesome um, steering components and stuff for all kinds of Jeeps. So for why not extra twenty bucks, you got a fully branded one. Um, and inside the kit itself, it comes with full installation guide um, as well. It come shows uh, what series of Jeeps and stuff it will fit. Uh, it comes with all the different uh, components um, that you'll need to either fit it to TJ or JK. Uh, really like how it shows you everything you need to do for the Jeep. It's really easy to install. All we need to do is put the new sleeves inside the new steering stabilizer. They've given us brand new ones from Terraflex themselves, which is mint. Where are they? I think they're those ones. They've given us everything inside the kit, which is great. Really easy to bolt up. All you need is a 18 mm um, either a ratchet or a breaker bar. I need a breaker bar because I'm on bloody tight. So 18mm for the JK. Not sure about the TJ and ZJ. Could be slightly different sizes. Um, but it's really simple install and uh, removal. Just the two bolts. One in here which is like a fixed nut. Like that. Which is really easy to install. And then moving along to the centre. You've just got like the little um, bracket there. And then just the sleeve on the back side. We'll be using the original hardware inside the um, on the Jeep. Now we've given thing a bit of a paint up to make it look nice and pretty. It was all rusted um, inside that little bracket there, and on the end of these. So we just got a can of 2K Rustolan paint, um, and we just gave the thing a bit of a touch up to make it look nice and pretty. So um, if you guys let me know in the comments below what kind of steering stabilizers you guys are using in your Jeep. Um, whether it's not the Terraflex one, maybe it's something else, but around about the same price. Let me know in the comments below. Um, everybody's got mixed opinions of having steri steering stabilizer and not it's be like, oh, you don't need one, you don't need one. I like to replace that. Um, not, 
I like the steering. I'm only running factory steering. Um, and this is a factory steering replacement. So if you guys do have aftermarket suspension, this might not fit for you. Just read the description on the um, SBR off-road website or just the Terraflex website and you guys can gauge for yourself if that one's the right one for you. Um, but I'm a fan of just running factory components and replacing with factory parts or just like better aftermarket parts. Um, just a lot simpler, a lot less stress. If something does go wrong, you can easily find something. So let's chuck in these sleeves to that and we can get the new one on and then we can give you guys a little bit of a feel um, and I can run you guys through how I actually feel about the steering stabilizer after we take it for a drive. All right, with this one, it's literally the bolt there. You got your one side, literally just slides over. We'll chuck the little nut on there to give us a bit of wiggle room. Oh, right, it up tight and Try and get this one back in there. Might be a little bit hard. Not a lot of room, definitely easier than the TJ, but not a hell of a lot of room. new boy in there we have to go from the top <sighs> hmm. we have to go from the top it can't really go from the top as it's hitting on the link just there might be able to force it in though Okay. Trying to get it through that hole that I like, just because the bushing is brand new. So all I did was get a screwdriver, um, and you can kind of just press it down and then just put it through that hole and just lever it um, just a little bit, just enough to get it built in. And we've just done that up loose with our ratchet. Alright, so we've had the Terraflex steering stabilizer in the Jeep for like the last couple of days. We installed it on Saturday, it's Monday now. So we've been driving around with it in the Jeep for a couple of days. And there's definitely a difference, um, especially at highway speeds. Uh, the steering wheel definitely feels a lot tighter, especially more responsive uh, when you're trying to turn. Uh, less jolty, I used to get a bit of like a bit of a shimmer, or the steering wheel used to move just a little bit every time I'd hit a bump. Now it's nice and stiff. Um, it feels more responsive, so um, as I'm turning, uh, you can actually feel the Jeep turning rather than like the steering wheel turn a little bit, then the Jeep kind of follows it, if that makes sense. Uh, definitely a lot better. It'll be interesting to see what it's actually like off-road. Um, will probably be the biggest thing to see any more um, kind of control when we're going over bumps and stuff like that, when we're actually out on the trails. On the beach, we're heading to the beach again uh, this coming weekend. Uh, back up to Double Island, so it'll be interesting to see the difference between last week when we're at the beach, then next week, or well, this week when we're at the beach again, just with the change in the steering stabilizer. For 120 bucks, I had someone off Instagram message me and asking, asked for a couple photos um, and the difference of comparison between them. And for 120 bucks, there's a massive difference um, just in the responsiveness of the steering wheel. It's not as slack, and especially going over bumps and stuff like that it's definitely a lot stiffer and a lot more uh, firm um, compared to the old factory one that was in there it's probably in there for like 11 years 10 years there's definitely a massive difference for 120 bucks it's definitely a great upgrade Terraflex steering stabilizer definitely with the muddy uh, very quick install maybe half an hour uh, install which was really uh, quick and straightforward so I'll leave a little link down below if you guys want to check it out. Um, but definitely a great upgrade for your TJ, JK and XJ um, and maybe the YJ as well. So link down in the description but that's pretty much it for today guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, if you haven't already smash that like button and subscribe button. It will help us out a lot. Just tell YouTube that you guys like the content and you want to see more. Um, but that's pretty much it for today guys. Thank you so much. We'll see you guys next time.